What up, y'all? I'm trying to get the iPad. It's going here, though. I know, but I'm, I need to interact with people looking at the page. trying to get this page uploaded on this uh, iPad, but the signal back ain't working. But what up, y'all? It's been a minute since the boy went live, so I decided to know y'all in the house watching TV. Let me be a part of this uh, Monday night uh, lineup. So I'm going to do this uh, drink called Blow Me. <laughs> yeah, it's kind of like not for the kids. No, nah, but uh, man, what y'all been on? It's been a minute since your boy went live. Um, the drink. I may make another drink. I don't know. I might give y'all two for one tonight. But for now, we're gonna do this drink called Blow Me. All right, this is what you're gonna need. You're gonna need some ice. You're gonna need your uh, glassware, a plate, your jigger cutting board okay and don't forget to shake her now what we need for, to make up uh, to make the drink is lemonade or sweet and sour either or i got some calypso triple melon lemonade watermelon blow pop i got uh pink sand and sugar we got our ultimate vodka and some white grape juice now the drink, the recipe called for white cranberry juice, but we got white grape juice, so we're going to use this. Uh oh, it's trying to load. I don't know who's on my live, but it's you cool. Use my phone? Yeah. What up, Gabriel? What up, Dinky? All right, so let's get started. We're going to put our stuff to the side. Nope, we're going to need this. So usually when I um, make a drink and it calls for the rim to uh, glass with sugar or whatever, I use a lime or lemon. But we got lemonade, so just pour like a, a splash. That's all you need. And what we're going to do is rim our glass in that lemonade and then coat it in this pink sugar. So, we're going to pour some of this pink sugar on the side right here. It's very pretty. Sparkly. So, forgive me, y'all. I don't know who, who on my live or whatever because this iPad not working. Let the phone not work. Here, you can come and get your phone. It's not working. Nope. That's what that, that's what Apple products do. No, that ain't the, that ain't the truth. That's what Apple products do. No. My Samsung was booming back then. All there. right. <laughs> so you want to take your sugar and ram your glass in the sugar. Now, this recipe to actually call for the sugar, but it's more like of a, a drink a woman may order, or a male, but he might ask without the sugar, it don't matter. So we're gonna rim this good, y'all. Like so, I'm almost done. 
All right, y'all see it? Boom. Got your pink ring around. So now we're going to set this to the side since we done with that part of the show. Next. We're going to start adding the, the liquids to our glass. We got some ice. I'll just buy my ice. Uh, it's just better that way for me. I got my ice. Now, what y'all want to do is, let me see, is this thing working or not? I say I'm live, but I can't see myself. Anyways, huh? All right, so get y'all some vodka, lemonade, Calypso, melon drink, Welch's grape juice, or you can use Ocean Spray, uh, white cranberry juice. So now, you're going to add an ounce and a half of vodka. You can use whatever vodka you want to use. We got ultimate vodka. We're going to pour up two ounces of this. All right, we got two ounces of our vodka and our shaker. Next, we're going to add a half an ounce of lemonade. So lemonade, you can use as a replacement for your sweet and sour. Um, I got sweet and sour downstairs. I just, a lot of people don't have uh, sweet and sour on hand. That's why I grab lemonade. You can use lemonade as well. We're going to pour up a half a shot, half an ounce of uh, white grape juice. Like that. Then we're going to add our uh, Calypso. Calypso got some real decent flavors. I don't think I ever had this before. And if I did, it didn't make it on the show because I drunk it. <laughs> I drunk it up. So, what y'all want to do, clip, so y'all ain't got to have this uh, label on it that's tight, this wrapper. Now, what y'all want to do, get that pop, it's fresh. That's a pretty pink. Now, I'm only adding a lot of of this so that color can come through but you only need so I poured about three and a half ounces of Calypso ju uh, juice in it you'll need that much then we're gonna take set our glass right here we're gonna put the rest of our ice in there like so my hands are clean and if you guys want to make this drink add everything to this drink if you want to make this drink for kids, you can add all the, the ingredients in this drink. Hold off on the liquor. And you don't have to call it Blow Pop. You can call it uh, My Little Princess or something like that because it's glittery. So we're going to shake this bad boy up. Shake it up for about 30 seconds. Y'all been on. Y'all waiting for Halloween? I'm not. I'm going to shake it up like this. About 30 seconds, let all them flavors incorporate with each other. We're going to pull up. Now, we're not done yet. Y'all know my drinks got to be extra. Fellas, y'all got your lady over, and you want to impress her? Go ahead and make this drink. Real simple, easy to do. That's why you made me. There you go. You like baby. She's like, yeah. <laughs> like, can you make me a drink? Like, yeah. <laughs> what you gonna make me? Like, baby, you make you blow me. <laughs> nigga, what? <laughs> nigga, what? <laughs> nigga, what you talking about? No, baby, it's not blow me a drink. It's called blow me. <laughs> I y'all dig this. It's simple, real easy, simple drink. <laughs> 
Um, like I said, it's called the Blow Me. I go over the ingredients once again. We got Sunkiss Lemonade. You can use whatever lemonade you want. We got Pink Sugar. We got Calypso Triple Melon Lemonade. We got Welch's White Grape Juice. Or you can substitute this for White Cranberry Juice. And we got our Ultimate Vodka. It's still from grains and potato. But you can use whatever vodka you want. Tito's, Smirnoff, Ciroc, whatever. This is what we got on deck or whatever. That good. And then you kind of like the ice is supposed to like. You, you float the, the sucker on top of the ice like that. It, like I said, it's a real pretty drink for the ladies. Real Guys, if you don't want this and you're into fruity drinks, tell them no sugar or whatever. The sugar just made for a better experience or whatever. Um, I'll let y'all get a close-up. <coughs> so, y'all got to kind of see the close-up or whatever. That boy rocking. Now, let me ask y'all a question. If y'all want, I can do y'all a two for one tonight. All right, this is the first drink. Who want a two for one? I can do another drink for y'all. I've I been wanting to do this drink. I came up with this drink first because I, I like the theatrics with it. As far as like the sucker sitting on top, the pink sugar and stuff like that. Stuff like this really uh, get people uh, ideas flowing. People like to try these drinks at home or whatever. I got a white grape uh, Ciroc over here. We can do the drink, a white Cosmopolitan. I think y'all want to, y'all want me to do it? Let's do it. You want to taste this drink? Yes, I do want to taste it. You the take drink. a picture? Yeah, I took a picture. You took it with the flash flag? It's flashy, flash, flash. That's London, y'all. Okay. That's the photographer, Linda. Yeah. All right. You have the martini glass. I'm going to get some ice. Hold on. You. Get those frozen grapes out the freezer for me. Yeah, this production is low level. You're going to see a little off edge. So be this fifth. It don't matter. It's, it's unedited. It's real. It's live TV. So, I tried this white grape martini along with that uh, peach. Can I drink? Yeah, go ahead. I tried that white grape, um, this white grape Ciroc on ice, and it was, I'm going to be honest with y'all, I don't like drinking any liquor without it being mixed in a cocktail. But this right here, just throw some ice in the glass, and you're good to go. Now, this bottle is very pretty. It's kind of like, you know, elegant and, you know, if you're downtown somewhere, you want a, a different martini, your boy got you. So, if you want to um, pour this in the other glass, give me a few seconds, y'all. Give me a few seconds, y'all. Gonna pour up some more ice in our shaker. Y'all just bear with me. Y'all get a two for one tonight. Give yourself a round of applause <laughs> for tuning me in. I can't interact with y'all because, like I said, I got Apple, Apple uh, product over here. Don't do that. And the signal is horrible. Um, it's just ridiculous. Senator. We ain't got no ice scoop over there. I got everything you need. Hey, I 
big scoop on that for the drummer fold. So we're gonna take our ice, add some ice to the shaker, like so. Now, this ice is sitting in the freezer, so I'm gonna teach y'all a trick. You got ice sitting in the freezer, and you don't have any, uh, I think it's baking soda, to keep the, the, whatever you got in the freezer, as far as like the uh, smell of getting on the ice, all you gotta do is run water on it. You know, you know who taught me that? Shout out to my cousin, Lavelle Jacobs. Charles Lavelle Jacobs, he taught me that. That's about a year or two ago. We're gonna set this right here. All right, can you push this water? I'll wash this off. Thank you. All right, y'all. All right, so this drink is a real simple drink to make. It's classy, it's elegant. If you wanna stunt for your girl, do something that ain't like, uh, got a lot of decoration on it or whatever, this is a white Cosmo. It's the same ingredients you'll add for um, you will add uh, for a Cosmopolitan, but it's a white Cosmopolitan. So you're gonna need your ice. You're gonna need your uh, Ciroc white grape. You're gonna need some triple sec, and you're gonna need some white grape juice. All right, let's pour up. Oh, don't forget now. Get y'all some grapes, freeze them. This is going to be a part of the, uh, to keep the drink cold, but also to make it pop as far as like decor for the drink. All right. So we're going to pour about two ounces of this. Hey, and this smell like white grape too, y'all. If y'all ain't had this, get, go get it at Benny's. I know Benny's got this for sure. And they also have that, uh, peach crown royal. And the, only thing is with that peach crown royal, it's only limited to one. You can only buy one. You can't buy it in, in multiple uh, abundance. You can only buy one drink at a, one uh, crown royal at a time. All right, we're gonna add some peach snack, uh, triples. My bad, triple set. Just an ounce and a half, like this. Wow. And then y'all might get a. Y'all might get a third one. Hey. Big fella, be gone for a minute. All right, now, we're going to add just a shot of this. We don't want the uh, white cosmo cosmopolitan for everybody used to watch Sex in the City. I think that's when Martini's kind of like got real popular again. And um, yeah, the uh, recipe calls for this white grape juice, but we're not going to put a lot in there. Um... Just an ounce and a half, just to give it that flavor. But we don't want the, chuck, the color to change. It's, it's a dope, clear drink. Um, now what you want to do next is add your frozen strawberries. Just about three. I'm sorry, I said strawberry. White grapes, y'all. I'm tweaking. Add your... Uh, white frozen grapes just freeze them overnight and you'll be good to go and we're gonna shake this bad boy up like i said i'm sorry i know y'all on here trying to uh, communicate with me whatever i can't ipad not working with the wi-fi back here so we're gonna shake up for about 30 seconds y'all no, <laughs> so y'all can see the white grape juice is all blended in. It's clear. That's the color that you guys want. You don't want to put too much of this in there because it's got like a, a, a caramel color hue to it, like a greenish, yellowish kind of thing going on. And this is for the people that like martinis. A cosmopolitan ain't but a martini, but that's just the name for it. But this is a white cosmopolitan. So we're going to pull up. There we go. And check that out, y'all. That's y'all white Cosmo. I know somebody in the family that love these drinks right here, Darice, from Loving You uh, Clothing. Oh, she loves a, a good Cosmopolitan. 
I want, you know, it might be right up my alley with the white cosmo. Linda. <laughs> Linda. What? I need you to take a picture. Okay. Did you hear me cough or something? She going my photographer. Because I home. was coughing. My bad, y'all. My photographer. What you do me like that? Mr. Johnson. What's so funny? Now you gotta catch it from that. I'm not ass. no. Uh, from the top. <laughs> <laughs> you feel good today, though. I feel good. But you wanna be funny. Now step back one and then Johnson. Get right. No. Get that that angle. Oh, okay, I got your angle. You wanna get that angle? Come on, man. You going to take the picture? Well, I did it already. What angle? The angle of the grapes. To see the grapes at the bottom. Yeah, let me see. Now, how you know the one I took wasn't like this? Right. Right. But this is your white cosmopolitan. Look at them grapes, y'all. Let y'all get a close up of this boy. I mean, pull it in. Hmm? Push it in. I mean, Somebody had a little bit too much to drink. No, I didn't have a lot. Y'all see the white? Y'all see the grapes? So the frozen grapes is gonna keep the drink cold. It's just to make it look classy. That is your garnish for this drink. Now, for the ones that may not want the frozen grapes in there, you can put them on a little toothpick on the side. Let them sit on the side. But this is a perfect drink um, to make. Um, I did that. Let me get a taste. Okay. That right there. On point. Man, it's been a minute. I may oblige y'all next week with another episode. Maybe this week. I don't know. But uh, I want to thank y'all for tuning in. I'll go over some of the drinks we just made. This is your drink called Blow Me. It's like your seductive, sexy in the mood drink and this is your white cosmo more elegant more classy so this is for your side chick and this is for your main chick what you know about that <laughs> oh no nothing about uh, it i just see it all on the book uh -huh. on the ground social media so i go over the ingredients again so for the white cosmo you need white grape syrup white grape juice and triple set now for the blow me, which is the side side chick drink, you're gonna need ultimate vodka. Why are you looking like that? You keep saying it. Uh you need triple melon lemonade. And you're gonna need regular lemonade, some pink sugar, <laughs> a watermelon uh blow pop. And I think that's pretty much it, y'all. So there you have it. Y'all got a two for one today. I ain't did a two for one. In a minute, well, I don't know if I ever did two foreign drinks in one episode, but like I said, this drink is real good. It's crisp. It's clean. Straight to the point. You want some with a little razzle-dazzle, the blow meat drink, that's, that's, that's your drink to go to. So there y'all go. There y'all get it. Let y'all get a close-up. Let me taste that. It's the white grape. That's your. You blow me. All right, y'all. Tune in, same channel, same time, 9 p.m. Thank you for tuning in to tonight's episode of Simple with Sin. I'll holler. I'm silly.